Hello there everybody, Aero here and welcome to Missing Hiker, where we are a missing- I don't know. December 11th, 1994. Ooh, press any key. My brother Ethan is missing for around 24 hours. See, this is why I don't pretend to give you an intro for the game, because the game is going to introduce itself. We just want to play it, right? That's what we want to do. He went on a hiking trip near the Red Mountain. He should have come home yesterday. I went to the local police. They said they don't have the resources for a search right now. So I decided uh, to take matters into my own hands. Let's go, man. Listening to Synthwave. It's snowing inside of the car. And we're dr we're driving. Yeah, I'm driving. But we're not going to crash into any trees. Nah, just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. We're going to... We're, we're going to... Oh, drive on the right side of the road. That's what we're going to do. We're going to drive on the right side of the road. As in the correct side of the road. Um... But you know what? I'm from New Zealand and I'm allowed to drive on the left side of the road. I'm used to it. But also the steering wheel is on the right side. So I should stick to American standards for this game. Oh, I see something up ahead. Do you guys see that? There's something. There's something. It's going to be a gas station. And that's where we're, where we're going to die. Or, or we're going to find our dead brother, Ethan. Ethan Winters. Oh man, the track's even finished. Oh, don't want to crash. I wonder who that was. Maybe that was the killer, escaping from the scene of the crime. Maybe, Maybe you are the killer. killer. No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I should park at this gas station to ask if they saw my brother. You know, I'm going to be an asshole, and I'm going to park. No, I won't park where they're actually getting gas. That's unfair. <gasps> Stop. Press E to exit. All right. I'm digging the authentic sounds. Press F to use flashlight. Yeah, let's use the flashlight. Let's... Oh, whack. Mm, driving a nice BMW. Okay, all right, all right. Coop, coop, I see you. I see you, two-door coop. Anything out here? Anything? Any- Ah, oh, white van. You can never trust a white van. What does that say? The- The comma- la, 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 Shop? I don't know. Oh, and there was another car there. I didn't even notice it. And whose Mercedes is this? That they've left on. 24 hours convenience store. All right, don't need our flashlight in here. What do you want? I'm searching for my brother. He went missing while hiking in this area. Sorry to offend you, pal, but that's not my problem. Also, you shouldn't just randomly approach people like this, especially in this area. What do you mean? Hey, look, man, I worked pretty late. I just want to grab some snacks and beers and drive home. I'm not in the mood to talk with people I don't know. I understand. Sorry for bothering you. Oh, well, you're never going to believe it when I talk to you again. Nope, never mind. What do you got in here? You got some beers and snacks? Snacks? What's behind that door? What can I do for you, sir? I'm searching for my brother. He was hiking around this area. He should have come home yesterday. Have you seen him? How does your brother look like? He has brown hair and is pretty tall. He also has gr a green backpack. Let me think for a second. Bro, look at that head. <laughs> it's going to take you more than a second to think with that shaped head. Hmm, yes, I think I saw your brother. He came in here and bought a few things. Some water and a few snacks. You're trying to find him. Have you told the police already? Yes, I did, in fact. But they said they don't have the resources right now. They said the, they only start a search if a person is missing for more than 48 hours. It isn't the first time someone went missing in this area. At least a handful of people went missing there in the last decade. That That's pretty normal, isn't it? People talk a lot. I've heard rumors that there are strange screams and weird noises coming from the woods. So you should be careful, especially going there at this time of night. There's a road right behind the gas station leading to the mountain. Make sure to stay on it. There could be dangerous wildlife in that area. Thanks, I'll make sure to stay safe. Take care. Give me those cigarettes. What's in the bag? What's in the back? Okay, I can't go there. And I'll see you later, big man. Time to get back to my BMW. And there's nobody in the back seat, right? Uh-huh. Excuse me. He said a road. That means in a car. You want me to walk it? Oh, man. Please let me take the car. Please let me take the car. Please say E. Please say E to get in car. Never mind. We're walking it. 
All right. I was hoping this is one of those games where I get to do it from my car, kind of like GTA. It's just a lot less scarier that way. I can sprint. Let's speed this up. Alright. Just yell out in the comments if you see my brother. I'll see it later, but it's okay. It's the thought that counts, you know. You can still see the lights from the gas station. Always safe seeing a gas station in the distance. Oh no, we can see a light. That means uh, there's uh, there's some something dodgy going on over there. Let's check it out. My brother's tent looks entirely different. I should still take a closer look. Oh, that's a tent that looks like a rock. Looks like a marshmallow. Enter? Can I enter? Hey! 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 hey. Whoa! 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 Who the flip are you? You scared the shit out of me. I scared you. I almost had a heart attack myself. What do you want? I hope you're not some kind of pervert or creep. I'm not. I'm searching for my brother. He was hiking in this area. Have you seen him? Nope, I haven't seen him. Wait. You don't even know how he looks like. Look, man. I'm just some guy that likes to hike in the woods and sleep in a tent in freezing conditions. I haven't seen anyone in days. I understand. You're planning to go deeper into the forest? Yes. I'll search around the area. I hope I can find my brother or at least traces of him. Look, you'll probably think I'm a stoner or something. But last night I had my tent a bit up north, and I heard weird noises coming from the woods. It sounded like a child was crying, but I didn't see anything. It creeped me out. Maybe it was a cryptid. Ah, nice use of alliteration. A what? Look man, do you carry? What do you mean? I'm talking about a piece. <laughs> you know, something for protection, like a gat, you know, a gun. You mean a gun? No I don't. Then you shouldn't be here in the first place. It's a war zone. It's way too dangerous to go deeper into the forest at night. But I'm not going to stop you. Also, one last thing. Don't creep up on a tent in the wood at night ever again. I almost would have shot you. Well, I guess I'm glad you didn't. Me too. Good luck with the search. Hey, you, uh, you mind giving me your gun? You mind giving me a gun? If you know I'm going into that, uh, dangerous area. Man, I feel bad for that guy. I feel so bad for him. Imagine just sitting in a tent and then someone comes up to you and starts sniffing around. I get pretty freaked out as well. But then again, I'm not very much a, a, a camper, to be honest with you. Okay, so we, ha we have a boy crying? Or the sounds of a child crying? Every time I play a game like this or see like a... Like a story like this, I instantly think of The Hills Have Eyes. And I'm not talking about the, the recent one that came out. There was one that came out in like the early 2000s. Some of you may be too young to have watched that, but but I'm, I'm old. I'm old enough. And uh, that started my fear of like hiking or going into the woods or these really rural areas. I'm not, I'm not going to spoil it too much, but simply there's... um. There's people that sometimes live out in these areas and they, uh, they're not used to seeing people and they kind of see them as more of a resource than anything. And the type of resource I'm talking about is, uh, blood, flesh, bones, meat. So I'm always just like, who, who's ready to harvest me? Who's ready to harvest my organs? There's some more rocks over there. I'm, I'm going to stick to the, the path because that's what the guy at the petrol station told me. It's getting really cold. I should set up my tent on the left side of the road. Wait, I got a tent? Wait, I'm going camping? I'm planning on... I should sit... Okay, so he's getting angry at me now. He's like, just, just stop. Just stop. Press E to place. My fingers are pretty numb. It's hard to build the tent. Man up. Oh, we got a nice tent. It's way better than that other guy's one. All right, we're in, baby. Oh, this, this is nice. This is kind of nice. It's cold, but I'm falling asleep slowly. It's cold, but I'm, uh, I'm, fall I'm falling asleep. Please wake up in the morning. Nothing is scary in the daytime. I knew it. I think I heard someone scream. Not sure if that was real or imagined. I, I didn't hear it. Did you guys hear it? Maybe I, I talk too much. I need to check. It could be my brother screaming for help. My guy. My guy, you should know what your brother sounds like. 
Alright, so, uh... Oh, there's a light deeper in the woods. I need to see if that could be my brother. I heard a scream as well, guys. But... Oh, is that the light? That's the light, right? I don't see a light anywhere else. Oh, it's gone. Note, there it is. It kind of looks like moonlight glistening on the water. Oh, I totally forgot I had a shift sprint. Oh no, it's a... it's a cabin. Yo, that's a well-lit cabin. He's screaming from how good his cabin is. He's just like, oh my god, this is amazing. I don't feel the cold at all. Let us see what is going on in this place. Of course my flashlight stops working now! Please don't. Please don't. I'll turn it off to conserve battery. There you go. Okay? Okay? Alright, so, uh... Let me guess, I gotta jump onto this thing to get over? That's my brother's backpack. He must have been here. Weird, the backpack is completely empty. Nothing's in here. Remember what I said before, guys, about the resources. There's people that live out here that just see you as resource. Alright, before we enter, we always have to check the perimeter. You know, that's, um, rule number one for these sorts of things. Because I am a police officer. I know how to do this. Okay, I see a meal in there. A succulent meal. Nothing on the ground. Maybe a little blood sp splatter. He's even got a TV in there. My guy's chilling. Alright, just, uh... Hands in the air. Hands where I can see them. So you're telling me there's all this light outside, but no light inside, huh? Press E to inspect. What the hell? Someone made a picture of my tent in my car. Okay, so I've got a, I've got a few fans, huh? They might be some, some subscribers. You know, just. And they've also got some meat over there. And I've got two beers. Wait a minute. I know someone that has beers, and I know someone that was near me in my car. It was the it was the guy. Is this is that a safe? Or is that a hard drive? It was that guy. It was the guy in the suit that didn't want to talk to me. What is going on in this room? Hooks oh blood. Oh no. Oh no. Alright, let's turn the generator on and get some uh get some music going. A meat cleaver. I have a bad feeling about this. I'm gonna go outside and get jump scared. Alright. Let's see. Okay, we, that that is that's the guy from the petrol station. Your body was never found. Screw you! Your body was never found. Why was my body never found? Was my brother's body found? Oh, who knows? Who knows? We got the bad ending. It might be the only ending. I'm not completely sure. But that was totally a Fears to Fathom style game. But I'm pretty sure in Fears to Fathom that people don't die in the end because it's a story told by someone that they made a game about. And if you're going to be able to tell the story, that means you must have survived. But anyway. That was great regardless. I enjoyed it. Loved the little story. Nice and short. Make sure to subscribe. Leave a comment. Love you. Bye.